it's your favorite girl i'm Ani Jelena, and i'm here with another video yes and i hope you all had an amazing holiday with all of your family even though this was like our first quarantine christmas i hope that you guys got everything that you wanted and also got to spend it around loved ones and really quickly before we do dive into this video, uh, I want to let you guys know that I did release an ebook. The name of my ebook is Facebook Ad Boss Control Solutions. And it's basically an ebook generated all around advertising on Facebook, the do's and don'ts, the how to's. It goes very into depth about how to get a success rate when it does come to advertising on Facebook. And uh, so you guys do know Facebook does own Instagram, so you can recreate a lot of the ideas that is in the actual ebook and convert it to your Instagram platform as well. So this book is definitely like super universal as far as helping you figure out what works for your business as far as advertising on social media. So if you guys are interested in getting this ebook, it is the very first link in the description box. I have a 50% sale going on right now on this ebook. So get it while it's on sale, save you some coins, okay? And some quick specs about this ebook. This is a pretty lengthy ebook. The ebook is 42 pages long. So there is tons of useful information for you guys. So just make sure you read it. And then for those who want to send me back a review on the ebook and what they thought about the ebook, you can send that to Amani jelena at gmail.com but let's just jump on board for this video as you guys can see from the title of this video this video is about not generating sales for your business in my opinion it's super easy to start a business but it's very difficult to actually have a success story with a business if you guys don't know one out of three businesses that do start up running has a 50 percent rate of closing their business due to sales. Sales play a major role. And when it, when we talk about sales, there's also like branding, promotion, there's all this. It's like, it's literally like an umbrella of things that you have to bring to your business in order to generate consistent sales. Me, I have been <laughs> jobless. I don't want to say that. I have been a full-time entrepreneur for almost three years now. In March, it'll make my three-year anniversary when I went full-time with my business. And it's been it's been an up and down roller coaster, but for the most part, I'm able to cons consistently make a consistent amount. So I do have like a projection log where I do make a certain amount, but uh, each month does each each month is different. For instance, for Black Friday, sales increase just because that's more of a shopping holiday and, and things of, of that nature. So some things that I really wanted to tell you guys when it does come to generating sales and why some of you guys are not getting sales because you guys consistently seem to ask this question. There is no secret sauce to this. It's literally about what you put into your business. And I notice a lot of you guys show up for people who don't show up for you. And right now we're having like a little chit chat because I, I need to talk to my girls. You guys have to stop showing up for customers that are not showing up for you and actually show up for the people who are actually interested in your business. So I'm going to give you guys a little example. For someone who has 100 followers on their business Instagram, a lot of the times our mind tricks us to say like, oh my gosh, I have to get more followers and then maybe I can get more sales and so forth. Yes, that is true. But you also need to take care of home. And when I say take care of home, you need to make sure those 100 followers that you have are somewhat engaged with you. You have to make sure that they're okay. You have to make sure that you're responding back to them and engaging with them in different ways and different formats that they would like you to, whether it's email, phone calls, newsletters, things like that. So you have to show up for the people who are showing up for you. That is number one. Don't always think about getting a, a new follower or a new visitor to your website yes those things are important but instead of always focusing on the future focus on what's in front of you and i've been saying this for years if you have been watching my videos people don't purchase products i'm gonna say it again people do not purchase products people purchase the lifestyle or the person behind the product and what i mean when i say that is let's think about cars for instance let's think about like a regular car we're gonna what's like a general car like um like a, uh, a chevy malibu for instance they're not selling cars yes they're selling cars but they're not selling cars they're selling the luxury behind the car which equivalents to the lifestyle behind the car that's why newer model cars 
I would say anywhere between 2017 and up have like a lot of really nice features. And those features could be like Bluetooth, um, uh, satellite radio, heated steering wheels, heated seats, things like that. They're not selling the car. They're selling the lifestyle behind the car so that people can ultimately purchase it. And that's how I want you guys to look at your business. Don't think of it, oh, I'm selling these bundles. Okay, cool sis, everyone's selling bundles. What What else, What what else is there? And some ways, for instance, when you have a hair company, you can, this kind of goes into promoting and marketing and things like that and how exactly you strategically do things. Uh, a way that you can figure out what exactly you're doing is, hey, these are affordable bundles that will have you looking slayed to the gods, okay? Like it's little things like that because you're ultimately selling a lifestyle. With me and what I do, a lot of people purchase from me just because they trust me, just because I don't mind jumping on camera, I don't mind jumping on the phone, I don't, rem I don't mind responding back to your emails. So people have a more personable connection with me because they know the face behind the brand, which is me. And that's the same way, same things that I want you to bring to your company because a lot of the times people won't make purchases just because they don't know. Hey, if I spend my money with this person, am I going to get the product? Is the product going to be good? I haven't even seen any reviews on the products. Like this, this, this is what your potential prospects are thinking. So in order to kind of like gain their trust, you have to be very noticeable. Be consistent on your different social media platforms. It's not about how much you're pricing your products. It's not about how much how many pictures you're posting on Instagram. If you're not getting sales, it's because a lot of the times there's no personal interaction or personable relationship that your customers feel in tune with to actually spend money with your company. Uh, and so you guys can understand that a little bit more. We're gonna, I'm gonna give you guys another example. Apple, Apple AirPods. Apple AirPods, they're literally just cordless headphones. There's not really anything special about Apple AirPods, but because it's Apple, people want it. So what is Apple doing? Apple is portraying a certain lifestyle. Typically people with like Apple devices and like high-end Samsung devices have like amazing, like really cool features and it's kind of like they get top of the line things. And that is what Apple is advertising, not, oh, we're just advertising headphones. No, they're advertising the lifestyle behind that. They're advertising surround sound in your ears things like that and that is what i want you guys to understand a lot of the times people are not purchasing because there's either not a message in the long run behind your brand or they're not comfortable with actually spending money with your brand because there's either no face there's no face for your brand you're not being personable with them you're not jumping on live they don't ever see who's behind this brand and things like that so this is something very important that i want you guys to actually soak up and actually listen to listen to me this time because i can guarantee you if you are more consistent on your social media platforms and when i say consistent i'm saying being on live for a few times a week uh, putting up different uh, stories on your Instagram or also business Facebook page story uh, so that people can build a connection with you and realize that, oh, she's not so bad. You know, oh, I would actually like to try that product because that's nine out of the 10, the issue. Your pricing is not the issue. People are buying Rolls Royce gold. <laughs> I can't even see. People are out there paying $500 for headphones. People are out there paying a half a million dollars for cars. The money and the pricing is not the problem. The problem is you're not delivering it the right way that your customers need it to be delivered. So one, so some a message that I'm gonna give you guys in this video is go back to your drawing board and figure out different strategic ways in order to get people engaged and also to show up for those who are currently showing up for you. If you have 500 followers, focus on those 500 followers and then once you once you have them by a leash to a certain extent, then start to introduce new followers to your business. But show up for home first. I hope this video definitely does help you. If you do have questions, you can always book a coaching session with me where we can really dive into the behind the scenes aspect of your business and see what's really going on and figure out a strategy that really works for your business, whether it's introducing different marketing tactics, uh, such as scarcity marketing, transactional marketing, seasonal marketing, things like that. And we can really come up and draw up something that really works for your business. So if you are interested in booking a coaching session with me, I'll have the details in the description box for you. Also, 
don't forget to head over to Imani Jelena dot co and order your facebook ad boss control solutions ebook it's a very well drawn out ebook that would definitely help you guys as far as advertising and marketing for your business it's on sale for 50 percent off right now so if you guys are interested go cop it okay while it's on sale at least while it's on sale save a coin but other than that i love 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 all of you and i will see you guys in my next video. Yeah.